Have you ever driven by a house like this in the Central Florida area and not realize when you walk inside, there's a little bit of bibbity bobbity boo There's magical rooms. And my girlfriend, Stacy, she has got so many different variations. I can't wait to show you. We're gonna walk inside and you're gonna be blown away. When you live next to the fairy godmother, next to Disney, everything that attracts people coming here is Disney themed, Universal as well as SeaWorld. So a lot that goes into these theme rooms are based on what's the latest and greatest attraction. This is magical and wonderful and I want to move into this house. <laughs> but on real estate, why don't you explain to me a little bit why people do this? Right. Well, you know there's the top 10 communities for the best returns for your clients, right? Right? Yeah. When people are looking to buy an Airbnb, they really don't even know where to start. So they need to go with an expert realtor, as in the fairy godmother of real estate, right? But the most important thing is there's so many doors, homes that are Airbnbs in Central Florida because Disney is the number one vacation destination of the world, That's right? right? That's right. So based on that, we need to make sure each house pops. And what better way to do that than theming the bedrooms around the area attractions. So when an owner decides to purchase from you in one of the top 10 communities, they're going to call me and they're going to say, well, Stacy, what is the return rate for my investment? And the biggest criteria is furniture and location, which I know that you know about location. So with that, if they have theme bedrooms, if they have game rooms, it's a proven fact that they'll get 36% higher occupancy and over an 18 month period, they'll be able to increase their nightly rental returns by anywhere from 24 to 29%. And that's just with themes. So if you're gonna have to furnish it anyway, you should do it right. I'm here with Kadu, and he is quite the influencer, not only in the United States now, but also in Brazil, correct? Correct. So tell me which one might be one of your favorites. Animal Kingdom and Lego. Animal Kingdom and Lego. So you guys, you're not going to believe this, but Stacy has this room where the Lego wall is in the room, and then all the Legos are neatly organized in these little cup holder type of things and you put it on the wall and you make this design. I think it's so smart because it doesn't make a mess and it's so colorful. It is always so amazing to hear which rooms people pick. I was blessed to stay in this house at Christmas with my whole family. So I got to sit back and watch what room my brother picked, what my sister-in-law thought was a better room, which ones that my nephew liked. And I was shocked that my 17-year-old son picked the Monsters, Inc. room. I thought for sure he would pick Legos. My nephew had beat him out to the Lego room. So you were <laughs> right. It was one worth fighting over. <laughs> yes. Well, I think you're gonna like what you see here. Surprise! Wow, look at this room. See, this is the Black Pearl, which was the ship on Pirates of the Caribbean. And now you're walking the plank. And guess what? There is even a treasure box. Sometimes guests come to our Airbnbs for more than just Disney. They come to learn about space. Wow, look at this. I want to sleep here. Right, doesn't it make you feel like you're an astronaut in space? Yeah. That's exactly what we were hoping for. You can learn about the different planets. When you're here visiting Kennedy Space Center, you've got the astronaut sitting there saying, even you can be an astronaut, Kadu, right? Yeah. What is in your and let's make sure the name of your company. Let's see. Yeah, I'm your Florida Home Design. We've been furnishing and theming out um, Airbnbs for 25 years before they were even known as Airbnbs, right? So in Central Florida in the Florida Gulf Beaches. So she's known as the fairy godmother of design. And so <laughs> we'll partner up. You just give us a call at 1-800-KIM-HAWK and we'll find that house and then we'll make sure that you bibbity bobbity boo it, right? Definitely some Disney magic.
Make sure that you subscribe and like so that we can continue to give you up-to-date information on all things that are going around the 25-mile radius of Cinderella's Castle because this is truly a magical place to live.